So we've taken all the information you've given us. So we've got the bow height to transfer, we've got the all up weight of the boat, we've built in a 10% headroom, a bit of a safety factor. Um, we've even discovered the vertical height of your winch eye to the keel. So we've specified the right winch post. And that's all part of the trailer journey about making sure the trailer is customized to your boat. So you're gonna get the best trailering experience you possibly can. So it all starts off with the chassis, which we've discussed. Uh, the SBS is a fully welded A-frame, so this is absolutely bullet strong. We spoke about the adjustability in the winch post in different heights that you can get to suit your bow eye. This, of course, can adjust up and down if it just needs that little bit of finessing. Uh, the bow roller, of course, that's really useful. So when your boat's on, that just stops pitching when you're going along or under braking or during the journey. And also as the boat comes on, it just helps lift the boat so the bow ring or the bow eye is just over your bow roller. So it's all snug and firmly supported. It's a great example here. This is for a stepped hole boat. The customer specified a spare wheel and tire, so that's on its bracket there. And again, that can be moved anywhere um, once the boat's on, so we know it's not fouling. You've got two swing beams here. And again, if required, these can be adjusted wherever, both up and down the trailer. And also, of course, the rollers can be adjusted uh, inboard and outboard to make sure it doesn't foul on any chines and give the optimum support. We've got our lovely proprietary step. And interestingly here, this particular owner has specified some floating poles, which are fantastic. So these are guide poles. So as the trailer is in the water, if you're on a boat, you might be unsighted. You can't really see the back of the trailer, but these poles are there to give a good visual uh, aid to help you line up. And I spoke about this as a stepped hole. So again, this is something SBS bought out many, many years ago. You've got some pneumatic rollers here. So when the boat comes on, it's fine. With a stepped hole, it just goes on, clunk, clunk, and finds its position. But coming off, the steps can jam against a standard roller. So these pneumatic rollers just help the step ride up and over to make sure the boat comes off and you can enjoy a day on the water.